You are welcome to my channel, Mindset Academy, where we want to solve this problem in geometric construction. And the question goes like this. It says, construct a circle touching three given lines, AB, 85 millimeter, BC, 70 millimeter, AD, 90 millimeter, DAB, 100 degree, ABC, 85 degree. Now, what you do, first of all, we're told that AB is what? 85 millimeter, right? So, what we we'll do is this. I'm going to draw a line AB. Draw a straight line, first of all. This is my straight line. So, on that line, let me make it more bolder so you can actually see what I'm doing. So, on that line, I'll mark a point. Let's say this is the point I want to mark. I'll call that point, point what? Point A. You can see that? Now, we're told it is what? A, B is given to be 85 millimeter. And I'm going to measure from 0 to the next point B is 85. This is 85 here, right? That is my point B. So, I'll write it out, point B. Now, we are not told that... Um, BC is 70 millimeter, right? The length of my BC is 70 millimeter. So let me just draw a vertical line here. You just get the logic here. BC is 70 millimeter. I'll just draw a vertical line up, faint line, and we're told it is what 70 millimeter. So I'm going to measure 70 millimeter this way. Zero to seven is 70, right? So this is what B C because after B comes C. Then the next one is what? We have A D to be what? 90. So not C D now, but I told that what? A D 90. So I'll come to A again and I'll draw a vertical line up this way. I'll draw a vertical line up this way. And then um, I'll measure the 90. So from this point here. I'll measure 90. So from 0 to 9 is what? Is 90. So that is my point. What? My point D. You can see that? Now we we'll move forward. So we move forward. We're not told that DAB is 100 degree. That means the, the letter in the center here is the angle. So it means that at point A, we're having what? 100 degree. So at point A here, we're having what? 100 degrees. So I can easily take my protractor, right? And place it on that line. Make me understand that my AD is not, my DAB is not 90. What it is now, this is 90. We are told that DAB is what? Is 100. So I'll just place this in between them, right? This way. Now we know that from this side downward is 90. From this side is what 90 and above so this is 90 then the next line here is what 100 we're starting from zero straight down to what to 100 you can see that which is at this point so it's this point now i'm not going to draw a line from a that will pass through that point this way i'll draw a line from a that will pass through that point so what does it mean it means that the main line that i'm looking for right dab it seems from here, from A to B is 90, so I'll just transfer the point here. So this is where I'm going, that is my what? My true line of what? Of D, AD. So I'll just draw it, I'll not take it this way. You can see that? I'm I've taken it. So that is what I actually need. And similarly, AB is what? Is ticking also. You can see that a is what is ticking also so we mean that the angle between here and here is what is 100 right now the next one now we have a b c 85 so that means the actual line this is a b c but the middle line the middle letter there is making me understand that what the angle is at what at b right so we're having a b c so the middle one in between a and c is b so the angle here is what is 85 so I'll just take my protractor and I'll place it here at this point. 
ensure it is well placed you can see that then i'll measure 85 so this is 0 0 3 then this 80 and this is what 85 right so i'm going to draw a line that will pass through that point this way draw a line that will pass through that point from point b i'll draw it this way so it means that my line um bc this is bc here i'll just transfer the point here to the true distance the true bc now will not be this so i'm going to what taking it you can see that so this is my a b and this is the actual distance here what d this is not the d here is that okay now so this is what we have so you need to understand that the angle between here and this point here this way you can see that the angle between here and here and here is given to be what 85 degree that is a b c this is 85 degree right and the angle between here and here we we'll call it dab and that is what 100 degree this is 100 degree now we've completed the first task the second task says we should draw a circle that's going to touch these three lines right we want to draw a circle that will touch the three lines that is that will touch um d a b c all together so what are we going to do you take your compass you place it at point b you can just draw an arc here this way faint line so where the arc touches the horizontal a b we'll call it b prime and where it touches here you call it b prime prime right so you can just extend it if you want to and you place it at b prime prime here with any given radius you strike an arc place it at b prime you strike another arc where they meet you're going to draw a line that will go across that point this way so where they meet let me call it point what point p so you draw a line that will pass from b through p right this way that's the first thing you do the next thing again you're going to bisect what the angle so the angle that i bisected i'll come to a d again at this point here i'll bisect this angle too so where it touch the horizontal line i will call it a prime where it touches this line here, i'll call it a prime prime right so with any given radius i'll place that a prime i'll check an arc i'll place that a prime prime i'll also check another arc so let them meet at this point i'll call it my point what point q so i'll draw a line that will go through what point q this way so where the both line meet here let me call it what point t or i'll call it point o right so at this point here that will be the center of what of my circle right that will be what the center of my circle i'll just take my um compass i'll place it at this point here and i'll take it to any end here right I'll do what? I'll take it to any end here. Place it well. Take it to any end here. Then I'm going to draw my arc this way. And you're going to draw. So you're going to thicken it. Of one point O. That again, make it very bold. This is what we are told to do how to draw 
a circle to touch three given lines right so if you have um, found this video helpful please don't forget to like subscribe and also share this video thanks for watching